Hi, my name is Elijah Dishas, and I am a features reporter here at the Gazette. And let me explain what that means because a lot of people uh, ask that. That's usually the first question I answer. Um, features is pretty broadly defined here, and um, that's good for me and for you because it means I get to cover a lot of the fun stuff that really shows us why life is worth enjoying and, and why we enjoy life here. Um, I cover a lot of restaurants, which is um, probably where a lot of readers recognize my name. I'm in Hoopla every week, um, covering new restaurants, and um, I write the Chew on This column, which covers restaurant closures and openings and all sorts of fun little tidbits. Um, I also write regularly for our living section with people and places. Um, I have the opportunity to spend a lot of time with people and get to know them on a personal level, um, and uh, just right? Human-oriented, positive stories. How long have I been with the Gazette? I've been with the Gazette almost two years. I started in March 2021, and um, we're almost hitting that two-year mark here. Where am I from originally? Well, um, the short answer is I am an Iowan by choice for the last 10 years. Uh, the longer answer is I was born in Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania, home of the groundhog, who um, predicts our weather every February. And um, I lived in Western Pennsylvania until I was about 10 or 11. Um, and then my family moved to um, California. We lived in parts of Central and Southern California um, for about um, six years or so. And then when I was a teenager, um, when I was 17, I believe, we moved to um, a little town called Tracy, right outside of Pella, Iowa, to be closer to family. And I have been in Iowa for um, almost all the time ever since. I went to Iowa State because I was tired of moving and um, my family lives in Iowa, so I've, I've made a home here. What is a fun fact about me? I am an avid uh, peanuts collector and not the kind of peanuts you eat, the um, peanuts like Snoopy and Woodstock. Um, I started getting the figurines when I was a kid as a gift and um, as an adult, I've, I've uh, gotten a greater appreciation for them um, and what they, what they mean to me. My parents used to write little messages on the bottom of them um, every birthday or Christmas. And um, I have quite a big collection now and I've moved beyond figurines. Um, occasionally I have readers who will send in little stickers or little trinkets of um, Snoopy and Woodstock. And I really love that because it shows me that um, they not only care about my work and they, they see the work that I'm doing, but they care about me as a person too. So that feels good. What do I enjoy about my beat? Um, I really am a people person and I just love going out and meeting people and talking to them and getting to know um, all parts of their life. Um, I grew up as a pastor's kid. My parents have been pastors um, for about 30 years now. It's been longer than I've been alive and I've watched them interact with all sorts of different types of people as I was growing up um, and as an adult and it really taught me an appreciation for um, finding the good and the, the intrinsic value in every person, uh, whether you get along with them or whether you know, that value is apparent and obvious when you first meet them. Everyone has a story and I just love listening to those stories and, and telling them. It's, it's really an honor to me. 